Hi, Corey. Hey. Welcome to the new Sunday segment. Oh. It's the Funk Bros Day. It's like a normal vlog like we've always shot in the past. Yeah. But instead of it being like a crazy action pack Friday? Focus Ode Friday or like a trampoline filling on Saturday, we're just going to kind of chill and just hang out with you guys and do what we want to do. Yeah, yeah. And maybe do a little merch promo, like be you and nothing else. Yeah, like we'll put this on Capron and accidentally stamp it upside down. Slash Funk Fam! Slash Funk Okay, okay. Uh, one, We agreed to one uh, for the, the, the bit. Just tell, tell them about the sad news. Okay. So some sad news happened. Um, the rats, I got Corey. One of them already passed away. We haven't given her name, haven't given her a name or anything, but it's just really rough news. And I'm sorry that Ruby passed. And then this happened right after. We need to get other no name a friend, and then finally name them because I don't know how to name them. Let's go get me another rat. Yo, so uh, this car behind us looks like he seems pretty fast. So I want to race him. Yo, you want to race? Here. Alright guys, so that's what we call a sleeper. It's a car that doesn't look fast at all like a normal car, but can beat any car like a Lamborghini. So uh, let's go get a rat. Alright, so we made it to the store, and I want to be respectfully quiet because there's a lot of people around here, and I'm not trying to attract a bunch of attention and being an annoying vlogger. So one thing I really love about these rats is they're just, they're, they're kind of like just like little cuddly things, and they only cost $4. So uh, I've always had like some someone to hang out with when I'm working or if I want to go sit down on my computer or go watch TV or something, I can always like hold them and put them on my lap or something. And just like while I'm sitting there like eating popcorn, I can give them like a little piece and I'll sit there and nibble on it. Sometimes they actually cuddle. They, it's weird, but they actually play fetch. And there's a lot of things you can teach them to do. Rats are very, very smart. They're top five in the world of how smart they are. So uh, we're going to get another one. Look at him. He's just sleeping. He's just up at the top. So all these rats here are like feeder rats. So I'm here to rescue one and take one home. You're all mine. Corey, what's up? You want a treat? Yeah. Yeah. What sit, do I do? Sit. What? Lay down. Roll over. Roll over. Sit. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Good boy. I just broke my tooth. No way. I swear to God, I broke no my tooth. No way. Look. No. Oh. I broke my tooth. Oh. I just broke my tooth. Hey guys, Alright, so I just broke my tooth, and I'm calling the dentist right now to get it fixed. Maybe tomorrow or next day, I don't know. Wait, hello? Alright, so I'm just not gonna eat. Um, so yeah, just get me in as soon as you can. Alright, to be completely honest, it was really crappy, but let's enjoy this moment of, uh, Introducing my other rat with the other rat. Yeah. All right, just so you guys know, I did break the very top of my like the entire tooth is like broken. But the only part that's like the reason why it's held together right now and it's not falling off. Oh shoot, it moved. Is that I have glue in between my teeth? It's a long story. Here, look. Here, I got it. Oh wow, they do great. All right guys, so it's the next day and I completely broke my tooth. Uh, it's really sensitive for me to like kind of break my teeth, not because it hurts, because they're fake teeth. Both of these front teeth are fake. And I've had a lot of teeth problems. Look, this one's dying, this one's broken now, but see how this blue on top? That's bruising from constant hitting on my face. And as you can tell, I did it again. All right, so I just walked over to the mirror and I looked at it and I, I snapped it so high that it's like, it was like in my gums, so that's why it hurts right now. Um, I'm gonna have to get this out like sooner or later. This might not be good, honestly. I might have to get like a full brand new surgery for my entire teeth. I just, I just don't want to have a tooth that pops out. I don't know what I'm gonna do. This is so hard for me. I have a dentist appointment today at like 10 o'clock, so I gotta leave in like 30 minutes, but I feel like there's nothing they can do. And it's like, I'm not like doubting what they can, but it's just, this is this one bad. This is the worst one yet <laughs> of a stupid dog treat, man. All right, so I'm not gonna pull my tooth out. I'm gonna let the doc do that. Um, if anything happens, I'll keep you guys updated. But otherwise, it's going further in the video. All right, so that's where I broke my tooth. I'm at the dentist now, and I am not a happy camper. 
I think I might have broke it twice right there. You guys here the moment uh my tooth out um i'm just gonna tell you the upside of this that this little black part inside of my tooth right there is what made my tooth blue and uh, because i'm getting a new tooth um by the way guys this is all fake except that black part that's my old tooth but uh the upside to this is that uh i won't have a blue tooth anymore <sighs> so here i am oh. That's so disgusting. Honestly, I hope you guys like understand that like I've hit my face so many times and I've always been so sensitive with my teeth and this happening sucks so much <laughs> because I hate it. And like, just to be completely 100% real with you guys, this is like a really prime time in my life to not have my face looking like a hillbilly. No offense to anybody out there. I don't know why I said that, but you know what I mean. That all, all jokes aside, it's just, it's a really crappy thing to have my tooth break out like this and uh, I really want to hope my doctor can help me fix with this because I really enjoy having teeth <laughs> well so far so good <sighs> all right it's a day later now I feel like filming for some reason the Ireland boys are here and I really haven't got to do anything with them we just did a recent video with them where it's like some questionable box thing Oh yeah, bro. You made a slight appearance in there. Your photo was in there. Oh, what photo? You'll my see, you'll my see. missing tooth photo? Ah, yeah, oh, dang it. So I knocked my tooth out. I did all the surgery stuff. You guys saw that. Um, well, I'm going to set up the entire rat's cage. That's going to be today's video. I want it to be a really, really chill day. Um, it's the last day of the Island Boys to be here. So they're going to give me like one high five and they're going to be out. So More than a high five. What? Maybe two, bro. Two high fives. Look at this. I'm setting all this up. This is not that much. Honestly, this is really underwhelming, but I'm gonna make it sick. We have two cages. I wanna set up both cages right here. And all of them cool stuff right here. One little entrance part right here. So right when they come out of the cage and they climb out, they can come right into the cage. Well, I wasn't imagining this to be this cool. So I just got this stuff. This stuff is called Aspen. I, I, I don't need to explain it to you. It's what they basically lay on. And it goes inside both the bottom of both the cages. And I want to show you one thing. A lot of people aren't fans of rats. So let me show you something. Right now you guys are in the rat's cage. I've never been in there. But look, they're cuddling. So I think that's pretty cool. This is, this is really cool. I honestly had no idea it was going to come out to be like this. And uh, they're pretty nimble, so they're going to run around the whole thing. Or they, they might be scared too because going to new, transitioning to new stuff makes them really stressed out. So maybe like further on in other videos, you'll see them running around because I'll update you guys for sure. Capron's home and we're not supposed to be filming. We're, we're not really filming today because we're kind of on our break. But uh, check it out. I want to see his reaction. Check it out. Oh, I'm not wearing pants, too. It's because it's hot. Did you do it? <gasps> Good job, Corey. Was you it like it? it? Did the dart rack go through it? No, not yet. Tell me if you like it. Cute! You like it? Yeah. Sweet. How long did it take you? I don't know. I just got bored. I was like, you know what? I'm going to do it because it sounds like fun, and I want to do something fun. Who's Aspen? Aspen's my best friend. Who's Katie? Oh, Katie? Who, who is Small Pet? Hmm. I don't know. we got to get down to the bottom of this. Except you're going to be like, where is my rack? Yeah, they're gonna be like somewhere in there. Yeah. We'll have to take it apart to like get them out of it. We just had the Ireland boys stay with us and look what they left us. Super clean. Oh, I'm so confused. And they did it super nice and I was like super Tatter. happy. Look at that. Look at that. They did, they, they did everything. Literally like the wires are out, the fan, they put the fans. Yeah, honestly, I love you guys. Ireland boys. Any YouTubers out there, you are welcome here to film some awesome content. That's what we're all about. Uh, and I'm getting off tangent. Let's put the stuff inside the cage. It takes so many days to film these things. So my dog has like a problem. She basically has like a parasite or something very wrong with her. And she keeps doing this on like a weekly basis. And so here, let me show you guys what I mean. Look how she just falls down. 
See, she's just like... But like, she's done, like... I'm trying to make it so she doesn't smack her face on the ground, but if you set her with more weight to her front, she'll fall with her face on the ground and then her body will fall. But she's been sleeping for two days, and when I mean two days, I mean she hasn't got up for anything. She'll, be, she'll get up just to go to the bathroom and maybe like go eat, but she's only eaten like two times, three times in the last two days. All right, so we took care of Myla. Myla is doing great. Uh, she has a weird symptom to where when she, while she's growing, she gets really bad pain in her joints. So uh, it gets really, really swollen like in her knees and elbows, uh, all over her body, even her back, and she can't move and she gets a flu from it. So what we did is we got her uh, the right medication for her and uh, she's all taken care of. So let's, uh, let's grab these little rats and let's throw them in. Come on guys. Come on. There you go. Oh, yeah. what's that? You grab the other one. So she's in the cage. I'm just gonna give her this nut. See, she wants it. <gasps> Come on, take it. Nope. Okay, so I can tell if they like, if they're comfortable right now, they'll take food. If they're not comfortable, they won't take food. So changing their environment stresses them out a lot. So I'm sorry to them, but uh, I want I want them to go through it because this is really cool. Right there. Right there. There's a hole. Come on, go through the hole. Okay, so I think I might have to do this. This is what Faze did. Is that he. Uh, he has to, he puts them like in one of these things or like up there and they have to go like through the tube. That's like their only option. So I think I might do that. Oh, 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 yeah, she went through it. Look, she get away from me. She, she's scared of me. So here, I'm going to scare a little bit more. So she's going to want to go through it. We wanted the mattress underneath and a foam piece and the land is softer. So if I do a double backflip, back up. Is there a clog in there? Why don't you back up? Back. Out of that <laughs> cage, into this cage. I, think I might leave them be for a little bit so they can get used to their cages. All right, so I tried grabbing her and she went up the tube. I mean, I hope she'll go all the way up. She's in it. Yeah, she's backing out. I don't know why. They're just not into wanting to go into the tube. I'm putting you in there. I really want them to go through this, like, like really badly. And if they don't, I'm probably going to get one more rat that's small enough that will go through all of this. And I'm... This is this is happening. Oops. Oh. That just happened. That just happened. She's going through. <laughs> Look at that. Which way are you gonna go? Back down? Into the <laughs> It's so cool. Oh. Alright, so I've given it about an hour now, and the, the rats have, have gone through here and gone up and then back down. That's pretty much it. And she's gone out and went back in the cage, and I put her back in a couple times. But I'm going to grab her and then put her all the way at the very top in here, and then I'm going to close it, and she's going to have to go down and figure out which way she wants to go. So, let's do it. I'm putting her in. There she goes. She's in. <gasps> there she goes. She's going. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Oh, she chose the dome. That's so cool. Look at that. It's like it's like if rats were ever to be like crawling around the sewers, this is what it would look like. Wow, that worked really well. Oh, she's going to go back up. This is so cool. Honestly, I didn't know that the, like she would go in it and go through like that quickly. I think I'm going to put this one in now. Oh look, she's crawling up now. Now she's backing up. All right, I'm gonna put that one at the top now. Close this. It's the only way you can go. She's gonna need some time up there. Oh, I could put them both up. Come on, there you go. In there, there you go. Okay, so they're both up in here. And there, there they go, okay? Oh, they're following each other. Look, they're following each other. <laughs> oh no, they're getting jammed. They're getting jammed. Oh, well, this is not, this is kind of not funny. She's freaking out. They're trying to back up. Oh my god. That was not good. Alright. There we go. Which way are you going to go? Either way. There you go. Same. <gasps> oh, straight down. That's a new path. Okay, I put it back at the top. This was, a, a, again, okay, so it's going to do the same process. Literally, I just put her back up. Yeah, she's going right back the same way. She's not going yet either. I really need to name one. Her. Oh, she ran away from my hand and now she's up here. 
Now she's got two other ways to go. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at her. Look at her. Look at her. <laughs> Come on. You can do it. You can go that way, too. Yeah, go that way. Oh, no, she's backing all the way up. There you go. Oh, damn, that was quick. I dropped her in and literally just went straight for it. She keeps doing the same course. There's there's one rat that's climbing through the climbing through everything, and that's her. And there's one that's not. <laughs> Look at that. Bunch of turns. Keep going. Come on. Oh, it's right there. You're right at the end. Are you gonna back up through the whole way? Yeah. There you go. Come on. Oh. Yeah. Go that way. She doesn't know which way to go. Yeah, she's enjoying the tubes now. She's just like exploring everything. Look right there. Yeah, go through it. There we go. Look at that. She just goes straight through the tube. I think that part where they got jammed up, like right there in that purple tube, really freaked the other one out to going in there because. It was trying to back up and it couldn't because the other one was in the way and it kept pushing and like and like kicking and stabbing with the with the nails and whatnot. So she got freaked out. Um, so I think that's why she's scared. And this one just runs through because she just like wants to get away, you know. So she just keeps going and then she gets interested because she's going further and further in the tubes. Here we go, right there. Let's see how she reacts in this area. Here we go. Oh, she went straight down and out and around. I'm taking the big wheel off right now. now I'm gonna set both of them inside of it. There we go. So I got one in here. There we go. Good. All right, so I'm putting it in place. I can't film it because I have to use both hands. I wanna make sure I don't hurt them. Oh no, it already went through. She already went through. I literally just snapped it in place and she already went through. Here we go. I have it in. Oh, look. <laughs> it's working for this one. It's kind of neat how that works. Now they both have successfully gone through the entire thing. <laughs> 